बम बमा बम बम सुस्वागतम वेलकम बैक एंड वेलकम टू किंग शिबी ऑफ शेंगो गेम इन टुडे वी गोइंग डिस्कस अबाउट द प्रायोरिटी गाइड ऑफ द एस सिक्सटीन ऑफ कोर्स इट्स एस्पेशली फॉर फ्री टू प्ले प्लेयर्स बट वील आल्सो गिव सम टिप्स फॉर पीप्स हु वन अ पे सो द प्लान इज सिंपल फर्स्ट वी गन फोकस ऑन लॉर ऑफ ऑफेंसिव स्टफ दैन स्लोली मूव टू द डिफेंस बिकॉज अटैक्स आर वे मोर फन दैन द डिफेंस सो फर्स्ट स्टेप we have is by the gold pass yeah i know i said it's going to be for free to play players but if you can't afford to buy the gold pass i would i would suggest to buy the gold pass but if you cannot we're going to move on move on from that so first most important to most important thing to do is the town hall i know where you guys expected this <laughs> then i was just kidding about the town hall of course everyone will be do, doing the town hall Then after you're done with the town hall you're going to build the blacksmith tip for the paid peeps who want to buy the 449 level 3 pack what you guys can do is buy the pack then directly level it to the level 6 and stop it because you don't need level 7 8 and 9 because as you all might know there's no new equipments for level 7 7 8 and 9 and for the free to play players as well you can stop at level 6 as well if you're pushing through the uh, blacksmith but if you're not then slowly move through the to the level 9 as soon as you're done with the blacksmith do your research lab let's put on a priority guide base i will definitely link this in the uh, description but until then we're going to uh, watch what you have here okay sorry um for the mode yes so first we're going to do our town hall going to finish our blacksmith we do not have built a blacksmith because we don't have builders then we're going to move on to our research lab because as soon as you do a town hall everybody knows you get a certain amount of boost that is going to help you uh give you forex bonus as well as give you a troop boost that's going to level your troops to the max level your research lab is so definitely follow that and do your research lab first after the lab is done you don't need to upgrade your pets because pets are not that great you can do your pet house after that because pets are good but before the pet house we're going to focus on the barracks as because barracks has the most opiest of the troop which is known as the root rider because it can destroy walls it it uh, focuses on defenses and it has a huge amount of hit points that's going to help each and every troop in your army camp to destroy the base and or as is going to help your heroes as well so definitely focus on barracks first then you can move to your pet house finish your pet house unlock the spirit fox use on the most important th- most important hero you want to use it on then after you're done with the pet house i'm going to focus on the bomb towers why because bomb towers are the most important defense as of now because of the super archer blimps do you do the bo- uh, do bomb towers they're going to they got a huge buff first of all that's going to destroy each and every archer blimp that's going to land in your town hall area or even the bomb tower area that's going to destroy each and every super archer blimp and going to make attackers life miserable so definitely go for the uh bomb towers then after that you can unlock the coolest of the cool merging defense yes sir you heard it right you can unlock the merging defense as soon as possible because merging defense has huge amount of attacking damage has good hp as well and is a major defense almost a major defense also uh when you're doing your merging defenses i would suggest to do them level 2 directly because there's no point uh, in waiting to level 1 uh, as soon as the 14 days complete you can directly put them on level 2 as well after the basic defense is done you have to focus your resources on the heroes yes i know because heroes are getting a huge buff uh even with the equipment when you're using your hero vial or should i say hero potion you're not just getting le- plus 5 levels on your heroes you're also getting the equipment to the max level so definitely focus on your heroes and the mm, blacksmith yes so as so first hero we want to focus on is the queen then the warden and then the royal champion max them out first then after those three are done you do not have you do not have to worry about the king because king is not that op at uh, 95 or 90 level 
yes it's good to have a max level king as well but it's not that important other because it's gonna be a side hero so then you can skip the uh, he king hero upgrade then you can focus on the two air defenses that's gonna help you a lot because uh, every troop every air troop has gotten a new level whether it might be super dragons normal dragons electro dragons uh, dragon riders what uh, whatever it is every every troop has a new level so you're gonna focus on the expos as well as the air defenses yes i know mine are from th14 because we do not have a max out th15 yet but i'm gonna still prioritize the way people want to see the content so you're gonna do these and you can i mean you guys might be wondering that why are we not doing the storages now right so first of all i want to say you do not the storages are not as important because even as a th15 storage guy i'm gonna say the storages are not that important because the most expensive defense is the merging defense which is going to cost about 22 million for level 2 and for 22 million you do not need to have max storages so you do not need to have a maxed out base okay so we have a maintenance break coming for our th16 so i'm gonna have to break it out now but i'm gonna finish my priority guide here before we click on the try again after you're done with your storages i'm gonna have to suggest you to do the mortars because mortars are gonna help you clear all the flame flingers that are gonna come for your defenses so definitely go for mortars then you can go for the king and if you're uh, feeling a little zesty then you can go for the wizard towers but before you do the wizard towers i'm gonna remind you to definitely subscribe to our channel and definitely like the video as well then after you're done subscribing you can move on to your wizard towers after you're done doing your wizard towers you can upgrade your traps which are uh, normal bombs because normal bombs have gotten a big big buff and they act like a giant bomb if you're stacking them up if you're stacking two or three normal bombs they're gonna have way more damage than a giant bomb so definitely go for small bombs first then you can move on to your giant bombs then to your air air bombs and seeking air mines if there is an upgrade for them that's all you need to know for your th16 priority guide thank you guys so much for watching and see you guys in the next one peace out